everybody and welcome to this week's tips video. Uh, as we've got our next webinar coming up um, a week on Tuesday about all about making the most of sixth form, uh, I thought I might just talk you through quickly a few points which will help you to understand what we mean about making the most of sixth form. And sixth form is really a two-year programme that is the start of building independence and experiences and life skills ready to move on out of school and into the next step of your education or your life whatever that might be so whether you're planning on moving on to university in the UK or in the US or somewhere in Europe or whether you are looking at having a gap year or whether you are looking at going into an apprenticeship or going into work whatever you're going to do next the sixth form is your opportunity to build the skills and experiences that you're going to need to help you cope. So sixth form, really making the most of those opportunities is all about, first of all, making sure that you're studying the right subjects. You've still got a bit of time left if you've started studying some subjects and you're not quite sure that they're the right ones, or if maybe you're not doing enough subjects, or you're worried that you're not really enjoying your subjects enough to do well enough in your grades. Sixth form is a big step up, step up from GCSEs, and so it's important to get the subjects right. So if you're not quite sure about that, make sure you have a, a chat fairly quickly with your tutor or the head of sixth form or your careers department in your school to help you to make sure that you're not narrowing down any of your options by the subjects that you've chosen to study in the sixth form. Along those same lines, having a discussion with the careers department or whoever may be responsible for helping and guiding you with course choices at university, now might be a good time to start that step so that you've got in mind what you're aiming for. Having a goal in life and understanding what grades you might need at this stage will really help to motivate you when it comes to the hard work that you're going to have to do in order to be successful in your sixth form studies. You'll have a lot more independent study in the sixth form. You'll have lessons where you're free and not in teaching. Use that time wisely because now is your opportunity to learn study skills about how to research yourself, how to look wider uh, beyond the subject that you're studying and to really widen your knowledge with a bit more independent learning. Sixth form is a lot less spoon fed learning than you find at GCSE. So really use your free periods wisely to extend your knowledge in the subject. Because sixth form is definitely not a sprint at the last minute towards gathering evidence for your UCAS application when you go into U13. It's about building that evidence and those experiences throughout sixth form to make sure that you can make the right strong application for university. So that's just one or two tips, there's lots more. So do please use the button and sign up to come along to our webinar, which is happening a week on Tuesday, so that you can learn more. It doesn't matter if you can't attend live, wherever you are in the world, if you register for the webinar, we will send you a link to view the recording afterwards. So that's it from me, Catherine Marks, the founder of the Independent Education Consultants, on a bit of a windy day in Yorkshire, but I have given you a view of the North Yorkshire your North Yorkshire Moors behind me. So I'll hope you enjoy that. And for those of you who have also enjoyed the Labradors, um, here they are sitting here. Here's one of them sitting here. And here's the other two sitting down here, waiting for us to carry on with our run. So that's it from me for now. Take care and I'll see you in the webinar a week on Tuesday. Don't forget to use the button below to sign yourself up to come along. Take care and we'll see you soon. Bye for now.